For Music Monday today, we have a talented singer you know from groups like Sponge and the Orbit Sons. Vinny Dombrowski has a new project that he's working on that comes out this month. He joins us now live to tell us about Diamondback. Hey there, Vinny. Hey, Jason, how you doing? Hi, Toddy, how you doing? Good, it's good to have you. People obviously know you from your work with Sponge. Tell us about this new project, Diamond Buck. The Diamond Buck project uh, is an offshoot of the uh, Orbitsons, and uh, there's songs that just generally don't fit into, uh, you know, the Orbitson band or the Sponge band. It's a whole different thing, because, you know, I love to write songs and uh, um, songs that don't necessarily fit those projects turn into the Diamond Buck thing. Got it. I had a friend named Brian back in the day, and we're going back almost 20 years. He used to follow you around like the Deadheads followed the Grateful Dead. What was it about Sponge uh, with such a loyal core following? Uh, the Sponge band just does not stop. So as long as we're out there doing it, uh, you know, the fans just feel compelled to come to the gigs. And we're very fortunate about that, to be honest with you. So we've had a good career that's still going. There's a new Sponge record coming out as well. So we're still doing it. All right. Well, let's talk about the sound uh, of this because it seems to have more of a country twangy flavor rather than alt rock. Would you say that's true? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been a big fan of country music for many, many years. So just, uh, uh, again, writing these kinds of songs are really uh, a lot of fun, especially the Diamond Buck uh, project. You know, they're just odd song titles and odd subjects. And, uh, you know, I get a kick out of writing it. I don't self, I don't edit, you know. I just go, if I want to write a song called Dog Hair Soup, I write a song called Dog Hair Soup. If I want to write a song about, um, you know, a love song called uh, Lopsided Love or I'm in love with a lopsided girl, She's not physically lopsided. She just come from a lopsided world. You know what I mean? So I just go, I'm going to write stuff like that. All right. Well, the first song off Diamond Buck's album, House of Weird Smells, <laughs> is the song Ghost Cowboy of Detroit. Tell us about this song. The Ghost Cowboy of Detroit, you know, for the last couple of years, I, I go back to the old neighborhood, uh, which there's n nothing left in the old neighborhood. To, um, you know, the uh, Gratiot Six Mile area, uh, specifically Houston, Whittier and Dickerson. And I go back into those neighborhoods and I, I, I visit it. And at times I felt like a ghost haunting the old neighborhood, mm -hmm. you know. And it's like that for a lot of folks that grew up in the city of Detroit. You know, you go back to the old neighborhood and it's gone. So uh, it made me think about haunting it like a ghost. My memories haunt it, obviously. And uh, that's, that's where the uh, ghost cowboy came from. I like that because at first I was like, this is an interesting title, but it has some depth. I like that. Oh, yeah, it certainly it means something yeah. to me. I, I think it resonates maybe for anybody that grew up in the city of Detroit. Got it. Hey, Vinny, I have a recommendation for you. Check out an old artist from the 50s named Wynn Stewart. Uh, he's got a really good Bakersfield sound, so that's my recommendation. To remind everybody where they can see you, both with Diamond Buck and you and the band, Sponge, how to get the new album, all that kind of stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we, we love to get people out to these shows. You know, this Casu Cafe show with the Diamond Buck uh, Project July 11th is going to be fantastic. But I think Detroit has a history of people coming from the south up into Detroit to work in Detroit and bring their culture and their music into the city as well. So I think the country music thing is 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 vital to the Detroit area, oddly enough. I mean, we're not Nashville, but a lot of folks from the south came to Detroit to work and live, and they brought the music, so pretty cool. Very cool indeed. Vinny, thank you so much for being with us. Well, it, it certainly is a pleasure, and thank you for talking about the new project. See you, Jason. Always a pleasure. Toddy, have a great day. You too. Here now is the world premiere video of the song Ghost Cowboy of Detroit by Diamond Buck. Back in the day when we were young in the streets in a place Nothing at all. You could walk down those streets and drink with cops, hear the firemen in the bars. Now my memories are no longer memories. I guess they were dreams. I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive. Why do folks see right through me? I'm the old ghost 
sucker, a chupacabra. You see, the shadow of a dog is just me. Oh, I'm the ghost cow boy. I'm the ghost cow boy. I'm the ghost cow I'll focus on good times and embrace all the bad times. But being beaten so senseless from inner city misery. All the breakings, the killings, the rapes and the robbing, all the drugs that we dare to feel normal.